Family, friends, and fellow officers gathered on the side of US-2 for a ceremony honoring a fallen police officer who left a great impact on his community. The section of town for approximately two miles will be dedicated in his name. A portion of US-2 in Norway was renamed today the Kenneth J. Maraska Memorial Highway. It's pretty difficult to really tell you exactly how anybody feels about it. I mean, it's wonderful, no doubt about that. Um, bottom line, it doesn't bring them back. It just brings back, you know, memories that uh, the community stood behind them and, and the family, of course. Officer Ken Maraska was born and raised in Norway. He was well liked in the community. This ceremony was long in the making, starting with a bill that was introduced by former state representative Ed McBroom. Well, it was great to see the project finished. This is one of the very last bills that I introduced while I was in the legislature and uh, worked very hard to get it done before I was termed out of office. And it's great to see what a meaning it has to the whole community, especially the Maraska family and to the city police department. Governor Rick Snyder officially signed the bill into law in December of 2017. Maraska was a Norway police officer who died by gunfire while responding to a domestic disturbance on May 23rd of 1971. Not just a tragic thing. I guess, you know. <laughs> You just, you just never get over it. Maraska is being remembered for what he was passionate about, which was the community and keeping it safe. I think the most important thing is the, just the remembering uh, the life of Kenneth Maraska and, and the life that he gave for this community. Uh, he was the son of this community himself, and he sacrificed that in an effort, to, in a job that he loved. For anyone wishing to pay their respects to the fallen officer, the portion of US-2 dedicated to Maraska is on the west side of the city of Norway. Melanie Palmer reporting for ABC10 and CW5 in Norway.